guys, it's Jen, and I just wanted to give a few tips about any personal branding exercises. So whether or not you're going through the plant, the Platinum Incubator, or you just want to be able to talk about your business with your friends, you don't have to be doing the incubator, branding is extremely powerful. So I actually had the opportunity to go through the Platinum Incubator um, many months ago in Phoenix, and I have to say that I started to do the exercises in order to complete it, and then I didn't, and I've come back to it now. So mistake number one, uh, when you start your branding exercise, like kind of stick with it because you start to lose train of thought and it gets really, really confusing. Um, I have two wonderful coaches, which are Tony and Carmen Matthews. They are, I feel they're wonderful people. And since I met them in Phoenix last year, I felt really close to them and aligned with them. And today we decided to finally solidify what would be my vision statement, mission statement, and USP. And it gets really, really confusing. So I just wanted to kind of demystify some of these concepts for you all and share with you um, a few tips that I learned. First of all, your vision is going to be what you envision the world to look like. And it's about your brands. Like, what does Jennifer Box Savannah's envision the world to look like um, especially when it comes to sort of more of my professional side. And then the second um, step is the mission, which is how do I help the world, the people, uh, my target audience get from where they are to that vision? So what is it that I can contribute to that? So that got a little bit sticky for me because um, I am an SFM affiliate marketeer, but my long-term vision is to also start um, an online marketing um, portal, a B2C model, where I'm going to be selling um, upskilling sales professionals so they can have more success in face-to-face -face meetings. So everything from the low ticket item to the high ticket item. Now I haven't worked on this business yet, but it's part of my vision. So a, a pitfall that I fell into in, the, in this whole branding exercise, and Tony really rectified it for me, is that I was looking at what is SFM affiliate business and what does my other business have in common to create a mission statement? And he explained to me, no, 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 that's not the way you do it, Jen. You gotta look inside and it's like, what is Jen's qualities, Jen's skills, Jen's values, Jen's stuff that help people get from where they are to the vision statement? And so it was much more general than I had believed. It's not per business. And so what I, what I figured out is that once I identified my vision, and then we, we went over and we finally identified a mission, this is after lots and lots of emails back and forth, it's really not that, that easy, is that my businesses will actually start to fall into place. So it's not the other way around, it's kind of like inside out. And the last piece we worked on is the USP, which is what makes me unique and um, different than choosing to work with another business that's similar to mine. And I struggled with that a lot because for me, unique selling point, um, I mean, I work with engineering companies and they sell fire alarm systems here in Dubai and their USP is, we're approved by civil defense. So like what I'm thinking is what is Jen's USP? I, I get a little bit confused. Like I don't know what to say. Like she smells good. I mean, I don't know. So, <laughs> so anyways, um, that was probably the most difficult one for me, so it was a little confusing. So once again, um, if you're building your personal brand, like literally building a, a website, or you just wanna be able to speak to someone and speak to them about what you're doing in this like, kind of vision and mission statement, it's, it's quite helpful and it helps um, define to you what you're doing and also to the people that you're talking to. So um, big, big shout out to Tony and Carmen Matthews, they have just, lit up my day with their coaching. And that's one thing I love about this community is just this collaboration. So um, on that note, wishing you a glorious day.